First, though, it's time to take your calls on getting a good night's sleep. Professor Matthew Walker is back with us, so thank you for staying. And let's yeah. get straight You're to the phone with Sarah. Hiya, Sarah. Hello. Hi. Hello there. What's the problem? Hi, Sarah. Hello. Um, I'm kind of looking at ways to help me actually get to sleep. It takes me at least an hour to actually fall asleep because my brain's just overthinking everything that I've done, everything that I need to do. Mm. OK. Yeah, it's very difficult, and I think we were just talking, you know, in this modern day and age, we're constantly on reception and we're very rarely do we go into reflection. The time when we finally do that is when our head hits the pillow, and that's the last time you need to be doing that. Several things that may help you, Sarah. Um, first, you can try meditation. Meditation has been demonstrated to help people fall asleep faster and easier, especially if you're sort of a little bit anxious, that Rolodex mind of concerns. Meditation is great. Also, the other thing is a worry journal. So try to write down all of those concerns that you were just telling me. Just write them down in the last hour before bed. And that catharsis okay. of getting those things down onto the page is an incredible relief. And just a, a study published only seven weeks ago demonstrated that to be beneficial for sleep as well. So these are real scientific studies with proof behind those There are apps you can get on your phone for a meditation as well. Like if you think, well, I don't, know, I don't even know where to start. Yeah. You can do that. Do you there recommend are, those? I do recommend those. There are Although, two of course, that are if great. you're doing that on your phone, that's to teach you rather than to look whilst you're in bed. Exactly. So you can put sort of headphones in, you can put it by the bedside, but Headspace and Calm, C-A-R-M-L-M. So those two things, great. Headspace, I would definitely recommend. All right, thank you. Uh, good luck with that, Sarah.